I know. I know. I know. You haven't seen me in a while and I can explain, okay? Okay. I can't explain really. I just got a little in my feels and thought I couldn't do this or thought that I wasn't called to do this. That, like what, what am I doing for you? So like why? So I had to take a, a breather for a second and figure that out, figure out my why. I have been loving yard work lately. I don't know what's come over me. So I've learned how to use a weed eater this week. I've mobile lawn. I plan on weed eating today. I have a giant lot in the backyard and it's like overgrown. I don't know. I'm gonna try to weed whack it. I'm also making a compost bin today. You can't smell this stuff here. It's a orange Tupperware tub, Sterilite tub, whatever, 18 gallons. I'm drinking some warm coffee. What? You spilled milk? So I guess we're gonna go figure out that spilled milk situation first. Well, this kind of had it under control, so it's fine. Everything's fine. Yeah, so my best friend came over yesterday and she just started in helping me. It was really nice. And I realized that I started isolating myself. Not like intentionally, I guess. I just noticed I started drifting off and I didn't. I guess I didn't really notice until yesterday when my friend came over. I was like, this feels really good to have human contact. It's different with acquaintances and like friends. So just having a friend come over, that was really nice. So what's been up with me? Nothing. I've not been doing anything but just taking my kids to local events. That's it. <laughs> That's all we've been doing. Um, and yard work. I've really been liking this. So, I guess, I think on the next video, I'll show you guys, like, my plants, show you through my garden. I also need to make that K-12 video, that online virtual school video. People keep asking me about that. I need to do that. Yeah, so I do have, <laughs> I do have a lineup for you and I will be consistent through the grace of God. But like, he is the only way I'm gonna be able to do this because <laughs> I'm struggling. I'm just gonna watch me make a compost bin right now. <laughs> I've never made one before. I thought I would have to take the bottom out of this. This is the big Tupperware bin I'm using. It held our crafts. So I don't have a place for our crafts right now, but you know, I'll figure that out when I get to it, when we get to crafting. Um, I stuck all the stuff that I was gonna carry out here and here. So let me get it out. That's some kitchen scraps I have, some bacon, some eggy shells, and some ground coffee, coffee grounds, whatever. So I thought, like I said, I thought I'd have to take the entire bottom out of here, but I don't guess so. I think I'm just gonna drill holes so it can aerate throughout. So just a bunch of tiny holes. Someone said like eight to 10. I think I'm gonna do more than that. And then holes in the top as well. We're living. Living our best life. Okay. Oh my gosh. Holy. The angels cry, holy. I just went for it. Okay. About a few good holes up here. That's all I needed. Okay. Now I have a bunch of just random like dry leaves in my yard, literally up on my porch right now. So I'm just gonna throw those in. 
start layering. Oh. That's what our leaves, that's what our first layer is looking like. Doing a layer of brown and a layer of green. So brown would be like your leaves. I don't know about tree limbs and things like that. Brown leaves, pine needles, things like that. And then your green is going to be your dirt, your soil, the um, kitchen scraps that you're going to throw in here. You're just going to layer. I just have regular soil. Because I had gotten lettuce from the farmer's market earlier this spring, but the lettuce didn't make it. I, I've never had lettuce before, so I think I over, I was about to say oversaturated it, oversoiled it. That's not even the right words. I drowned it, I'm pretty sure. Like it stayed, the soil stayed wet, but um, we had storms for like three weeks, so I think the storms just took it out. Anyway, I have the box and the dirt from that. So I think I'm gonna put that for my next layer in here. Then I'm gonna put another layer of leaves. More leaves on here, and then I'm going to throw maybe a layer of dirt. I've just been pulling dirt from under our trampoline right here. So let's do one more layer. Whoop, whoop. Because I've been doing some landscape and there's already a bag of dried leaves here. So hopefully without getting bit. Uh, I'll meet you under the trampoline next for the dirt, the next layer. Okay. Um, this is not ideal, but it's fine. Uh, there's that layer of dirt. If I, ah, uh, you know, one day I will be good at filming. <laughs> Now I'm going to throw my kitchen scraps. Throw them on top. I know, like, people have said that eggs don't break down unless they're, like, put into dust, but this is what I'm doing right now. This is the best I can do. <laughs> so, I'm proud of myself. <laughs> And then maybe in my next stage, I can start powdering them. But for now, this is doable for me. Well, this is super encouraging. There's a lot of information out there about everything. So don't make things harder, I guess, than what it needs to be. I also need to take that note. Lid. I look crazy. Okay. And oh my gosh, look at our compost bin. Very proud.